about old. Let me show you what old does. Okay, old reads. And I'm going to read you. Hey, Couture Bays, it's your girl, Brooke Brat, going live with the Read Talk and Bay Squad. We got to talk about y'all faves. But first, before we get started, let's like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not facts. Everything we say here is allegedly and for entertainment purposes solely. So sit back, relax, sip you some apple juice or my fave, the vegan water, and let's get into the mess, shall we? Let's start off with Miss Tiffany Haddish because I've seen everything online about this second DUI and oh my goodness, where is her village? Where is her team? I honestly feel like we are seeing somebody spiral right before our eyes. I do believe she's being taken advantage of. I do not care how y'all feel about it. This is my opinion, not y'all's. I do feel like she's being taken advantage of. I do feel like she was the flunky to Jason Lee. And it's starting to get to her because she was at the top. I just didn't like her red carpet antics. But she doesn't deserve to just <laughs> give up on life like, bitch, fight back. That's just how I personally feel about it. Y'all send up some words of affirmation to Tiffany Haddish. Moving right along. Let's get into Nicki Minaj, the queen of rap. So she is releasing these nails and I'm so excited. I'm definitely going to get it because I'm going to be rocking every and anything for this Pink Friday 2 tour. I'm telling y'all, I am booked and busy. I've already claimed it. I've already laid my state for the 2024. I'm here for it. I did see a lot of male barbs feeling some type of way. And I'm like, child, y'all can buy these nail sets for your homegirls, your sisters, your mamas, your aunties, hell, even your boyfriends. Like, why y'all being so mad? Like, Nicki Minaj is a woman. She needs to do things for the women. Like, sheesh. Like, stop fighting in the kingdom. On to the next. On, on to the next. Let's talk about Bel Kanana now. Bel Kanana, girl. They say Atlantic is dropping everybody. They are shelving your album. They are tired of pretending like you are heaven sent when you really been a bane of their existence. You had them in like 11 lawsuits. You're actively working in a couple still now. Like they spent millions on you not to get billions back from you. You know that's how the industry works, okay? They spent millions on you to not get billions back, baby, please, please. No wonder they're going broke. Do y'all believe it? No wonder your homegirl's trying to go to the Virgin Islands, okay? I say no. I hope he's listening. Do not let that career criminal go nowhere out the country to live her best life to do any spiritual, you know what, down in the waters or whatever. On to the next. Tiana Taylor and Iman. This has to be the messiest celebrity divorce I've seen to date. And I, I say that with all respect. At the end of the day, we were right on the money base squad. I know a lot of people were out here trying to spin the narrative because she was spinning the narrative. But let me tell you something to my sad sister. You cannot save him. Don't save him. He don't want to be safe. Don't save. I want to be safe. Iman didn't want to be safe, homegirl. See, you was over there doing a Bobby on the Builder. Oh, he was going through something. I felt like I had to love him back to life. And look how he is treating you. Look how he is showing you he don't care about y'all children. Do you think he cares about Junie and Rue when he's out here with his hoes in 4K? Especially the one who's out here, the, the hoodoo voodoo practice lady. Like... Tiana, this is what I was talking about before. Sometimes you got to let go of the bad things and I understand you don't want to do it. And I understand you want to protect his image, but he's not protecting yours. He does not care. He made sure we could see all the details in the court case. And I believe you have an insider leaking things to the press. You need the clean house, Tiana. Clean house, okay? Especially if you're dealing with somebody who's a narcissist. He was insecure. He hated the spotlight. Even though I feel like musically, you was not the it girl, but aesthetically you are. At the end of the day, taking care of a man, putting a man in positions to win, they will resent you. And he resents you because everything he has 
it is attached to you in some form or fashion. It is what it is. And like I said, when you got pregnant the first time, girl, I hope you over there because you want to be and not because you forced to be. But now we seeing things coming to the light. But y'all, how are y'all feeling about this video? Did y'all watch that Tasha K Hazel? E! Baby, we got to discuss it. And on that note, what are your thoughts? Comment down below. I got to go. Bye, hoes.